whether you go to college or not, you're still gonna have to network. You're still gonna have to meet people. You still have to talk to people. You still have to have connections. Hey guys, yes, I'm in the truck again. It's raining today, but uh, we just passed inspection on a job in Southampton. But I wanna talk real quick about change. All right, when you're in business, and this goes for any industry, you change on a daily basis. You constantly change, you constantly tweak, and you do that to meet the demand of your clients and your customers. Because if you don't, those clients and customers are not gonna use you, you're not gonna become profitable, or you're not gonna remain profitable, all right? Every good business is constantly trying to better themselves, all right? We started this foundation, the Ryan Anthony Head Start Fund. We have business owners that go from $2 billion a year in sales to a million dollars a year in sales, so it varies. So when I go and I meet with school districts, I'm normally nine times out of 10 met with open arms. You know, they're, they're, they've been waiting for something like this to come around. They, they want their students to become successful in life after they graduate, a large majority, all right? There are some people in these meetings that I see and I'm looking around the room and probably could care less. And that's with any career and I get it, you know, there's great teachers that are there because they love teaching and there's, there's teachers that are there for the money and there's teachers who really just don't don't care. You know, just like there isn't, you know, whatever, police department, construction, anything. You know, you're always gonna have that. Not everybody's gonna really love and really care about what they do with their job. But what we're doing is by teaming up all these companies that we have on the island and we're doing a real good job of it and we're starting to raise a lot of money, we're gonna start applying pressure. So we're going into the school districts very nicely with a very nice approach and nine times out of ten we're met positive sometimes we're met with hey there's a lot of red tape to do something like this and whenever things are hard and people aren't going to get paid more to do more work it's harder to motivate those people to do and make a change but i think and i think everyone agrees with me that we are well overdue for a change in our educational system all right so the more people that get involved in this and the more people that sign up, the more pressure we can put on our local officials, superintendents, school boards, stuff like that, to let them know that this is what business and industry needs. We need to create better paths for our future generation to become successful. We gotta make different paths that meet different molds. And like I said, it, it's not talking just bad about college because um, that's not what we're doing. And I was in a meeting the other day and you know, the kids that are going to college, I encourage them to get involved in this too because we're networking with a lot of different companies that need college bound students too. You know, This is more of like an awareness that whether you go to college or not, you're still gonna have to network. You're still gonna have to meet people. You still have to talk to people. You still have to have connections, All right? This is really what we're trying to hammer home. So. The Ryan Anthony Head Start Fund, lookwhomadeit.org. Please check it out. Please see what we're doing and please get involved. All right, I hope to talk to you soon.